what is up, you guys? I completely forgot that I was supposed to show you how these molds from Shattered Shapes turned out. And um, if you guys see the video the other day, which I will link in this um, video, here are the ones she sent me as demo pieces. She definitely took her time to round these edges off and make them beautiful and refined. She does lovely work, as you can see. Um, mine turned out to be more like a golden pie. And this is the mold, and these are the pieces that I did. I think that they look super fun. They look almost like um, a petri dish piece, but they're geode shaped. Or to me, it's kind of like a pie. So I may try to do a pie out of this coming up. So let's see the other ones. How fun. That's a, I think, 007 gold. Oops. That floats like that. Let's see what the back looks like. It really does look how the, um, alcohol inks in a petri dish look a little bit. Don't you think? I think so. And then take the next one out. I used art coat resin so it's still a little bit bendy. These are about um, three days set. Possibly four. It's so fun and I love how you can see through them. I tried to make it a little bit swirly, so that's fun. And then the last one. Yeah, it looks super fun. This one I tried to do a little bit too much to it, so it kind of got a little bit cloudy. I added too much heat. But the back sure does look a lot of fun. Whoops. Ta -da. So in order to finish these off, a la um, Nina of her Shattered Shapes. I'm just going to use one of these Pen Touch pens in gold. This is a medium. I'm just going to color this in. And you can also just mask it off and spray paint it. Or you can get some like liquid leaf and take a paintbrush to it. You can really, or just paint it with acrylic or just leave it raw. I think it looks good either way. If you like these gold pens, I have them linked in my Amazon link down in the description below, I do believe. I like these because they're like a little bit shimmery, but not too gaudy. They definitely shine. So that's something I, I really like. Um, Nina does sell these on her website. They are 80 Australian. I'm not sure what that translates into for US, but I'm working on getting some, um, like negotiating out a price with her so that I can carry them here for you guys without having to cover international shipping. Hopefully I'll have that worked out in the next few days. And if so, I'll do another video on these. Um, she does take her time when she makes her stuff and she does make them to order. So I, mean, I can understand the price tag a little bit. But if that's something you guys would be interested in, please comment down in the description box below. Or if there's something else that you want a mold of, whoops. Take your time doing this so you don't misfire. But if there's something else you guys are interested in, let me know. Sorry, that was my little palm pup Bowie just making a cameo down there. a gold ring around it. How fun! 
I'm super pumped about these, you guys. And they're like reversible, so if you want them this way, they'll you put a cup over it. If you don't, you have it this way and put a cup over it. If you have a favorite way though, um, not that this would scratch any surface, but we have these little clear bumpers that are also on our Amazon link down in the description below. Just put those little guys on here and you can extra protect any surface that you want to set these on. Also, if you're interested in seeing how I made these, not the mold, but these, I will link it up in this video so you can check it out. It's, I did them like a couple days ago. But this is a close up of the mold. It is silicone and it's shiny so that your pieces come out shiny. If it were cloudy, like the edges are not shiny, that's why these have no shine to them. They're cloudy looking. See, you can't see through those. It has that haze to them. Okay, Bowie. But on the top, it's shiny because this part's shiny. Not sh Bowie, enough. Not shiny, not shiny. Shiny, shiny. Keep that in mind when you purchase your Silicone molds. If the mold is shiny, your piece will be shiny. And I just want to show you this set of posters all put together. It really makes me want to do a pie. How fun. Sorry, those are puppy meds. Billy overdid it this past week and now has a sore leg, not a broken leg, not a fractured leg, just a little bit sore, so it's anti-inflammatory meds. Anyways, so let me know what you think. And if you um, want any kind of mold moving forward, let me know what kind. And I will see if I can find them for you. Till then, be kind to one another. You never know what someone may be going through. Bye. Bye.